We've been talking a lot about fuel additives lately here on Amzilla Garage, but it's for good reasons. There are a ton of things fuel additives can improve within a diesel engine and its fuel components. The reason fuel additives are necessary is really because of the diesel fuel itself, as well as biofuels. We're gonna get into the details of fuel on this episode of Amzilla Garage. Hey everyone, I'm Greg Jones for Engine Builder, and today we're gonna to talk about biofuel, also known as biodiesel. When it comes to diesel fuel, the refinery blends fuel based on seasonal averages by region. And when they blend fuel, they'll blend something like number two ultra low sulfur, and from there, they have choices. They can either blend in cold flow improvers to improve its cold weather operability, or they blend in number one fuel or a combination of both. Fuel stations typically do what's most cost effective. Number one fuel is more expensive to make, so a lot of times they'll start the season off with a number two fuel with cold flow improvers. And then as the season goes on and the temperatures get colder and colder, they'll start to blend in number one and number two fuels together. Again, that blend is based on seasonal averages and can be a little dependent on the fuel station. If that station does something unique, they typically advertise it. If not, it's typically ASTM 975 fuel, which is a standard fuel parameter. Biofuel is mandated in this country, and it has some inherent advantages to it. It has lubricity that number two fuel does not have, and it comes with a higher cetane level that number two fuel can't provide. However, it struggles with cold weather operability and it struggles with deposit formation. Many cold climate areas only run biofuels from spring to early fall, because biofuels do not do well in cold temperatures. Most states have some mandate on when fuel stations can use it, but some states don't require it at all. And some states merely require that you have to have a certain percentage of biofuel, typically 5, 10, or 15%, which varies state by state. In warmer states, they may run biofuel all year round. In the northern half of the lower 48, it's probably a good four to six months that they don't use it based on temperature. Again, because biofuel or biodiesel doesn't do well in cold weather and can form deposits that can clog up your fuel system, running fuel additives on an every tank basis gives you the best insurance and protection against something going wrong in your engine. Additive chemistries from companies like Amsoil will take care of those variations and fuel quality issues by giving you performance that you didn't get out of the pump handle. The proactive approach to running fuel additives every time you fill up will protect your fuel pump, your injectors, your combustion chamber, and your entire fuel system. The choice is ultimately yours, but wouldn't you prefer to have peace of mind? All right, guys, well, that does it for this episode of Amzola Garage. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.